Hello friends and welcome to my channel. In this video we'll make an old school uh, power supply with all these parts. Let's start. So here we have all the parts that we need to build this uh, power supply. This is the aluminium case you can see I draw when I have to make hole from these parts. Here is the power transistor. This is the power socket, power cable. This is the fuse. This aluminium case it's also the heat sink for this uh, power transistor. This is the transformer, 24 volts and uh, 5 amps. This is a kit uh, bought from China. Here are all the parts, I just have to solder all the parts here. These are multi-turn potentiometers. This is the ammeter voltmeter. And these are the banana sockets. First of all, I will prepare this front of the case. After that, I uh, will mount voltmeter the power button. And after that, I will solder all the parts here. So let's start. After one day of work, everything is put together. You can see. I fixed here the transformer. Here is the PCB. This is the final transistor, power transistor. These are the multi-turn potentiometer. This is the LED for current protection. I hope that you like this final stage. When when uh, I first mount this, I didn't make the first test with this big transformer. For the test, I used this small transformer with small current to ensure that I will not burn the PCB if something is wrong. La luckily, all was perfect and after the test with the small transformer i put the big transformer and everything works okay now let's make some tests So minimum current, the voltage, you can see the voltage jump from uh, 0 to 30 volts. I think this potentiometer is bad. 
and I will replace it because doesn't work linear how it should now let's make some tests I will use this download I hope that you saw the video about this As you can see, the current uh, regulation works perfect. And this potentiometer also works. As you can see, the current is increasing. And the current is increasing, the voltage is increasing. Here voltage is to the maximum, 1 amp, 1.5 amps, 2 amps, 2 amps. and uh, approximately 3 amps. This uh, power supply as you know it's 30 volts and 3 amps and the maximum current limiting it's 3 amps it's not very warm yet but when will be warm the cooler will have high speed power transistor it's not warm I uh, have to tell you what I don't like to these uh, linear power supplies when we need a small voltage like uh, 5 volts and high current like 3 amps then the power transistor will dissipate a great amount of power and uh, will be uh, low efficiency and uh, will be extremely hot because of that power as you can see now this became hot and when this became hot the cooler starts and that's the only reason I don't like this now we have high current and high voltage and uh, when we have high current and high voltage this power transistor it's uh, not uh, this it's uh, completely uh, almost completely close and don't dissipate uh, much power we don't have uh, we have high efficiency when we need uh, high voltage and high current and the low efficiency when we need uh, lower voltage and high current I didn't calibrate this uh, ammeter voltmeter let's check it if it's good it's good we have a uh, twenty two point four volts it's good the current I 
I've replaced this uh, potentiometer. I write bad on it and now everything works perfect. I think in my next video will be about this multi-turn potentiometer, what it's made, what have inside. If you want to see it, please follow my channel. Now let's see. Let's put current to the maximum. So this is maximum current. Let's now let's check the voltage. As you can see, voltage drops linearly. 60 volts, 15 volts, 14. Ten volts with uh, bad one, as you can see, jump from one to three to thirty volts. As you know, I made a lot of SMPS uh, power supply and uh, if you need, I can make a special video with uh, advantage a disadvantage of e each one. Linear power supply and SNPS power supply. You will find uh, all the PCB, the schematic link in the description. I hope that you liked this video. If you find this helpful, please like and subscribe. See you in my next video. Bye now.